Good evening, I'm Jayla Anderson, and this is Bullet News. Tonight, we bring you a shocking update on the ongoing conflict between NATO forces and the terrorist organization known as the Red Scorpions, just days after the tragic terror attack in Prague on March 13th, where Minister Major General Karl May von Mihaj promised a thorough investigation in cooperation with the NATO Rapid Response Team. The situation has taken a dire turn. In a planned NATO operation aimed at apprehending key terrorist figures, including the infamous Butcher and Red Sonja, the mission has ended in failure. Major General Carl May has been captured by the Red Scorpions, led by Red Sonja herself. The terrorist group has already started to exploit this situation for their propaganda. A distressing video has surfaced on the internet showing Major General May being subjected to waterboarding. This video is reportedly being used as new material for their recruitment efforts. What will be NATO's response to this brazen act? The world waits with bated breath to see how the international alliance will react to this blatant provocation and what measures will be taken to secure the release of Major General May. Stay tuned to Bullet News for updates as this story develops. I'm Jayla Anderson. Good night. Loni byl hod na dva teroristy. První terorista ze zní východu, druhý terorista Rudá Sonja opět z východu. V obě dvě ty jednotky my jako na to jsme víceméně zničili, bohužel ze zní, který mluvil, a Rudou Sonju osvobodil někdo a zvrhla taky. Půl roku o nich nebylo slyšet, až najednou jsme se dozvěděli na ministerstvu, že se někde dali dohromady a najednou se objevili s teroristickou skupinou někde v Česku u Prahy. Když půjdeme potom, tady půjdeme, tady tudy, budeme zahybat doprava, kde bude po 100 metrech naše základna. Tamhle za tím rohem už jsou miny, už jsou svině, kde tam jsou někde zašetí, už tam jsou snahy, tři půjdou po nás. Náš úkol je jednoduchý. Se dokáže zabít řezníka, pokud ho zabijeme, máme bod. Unést rudou Soniu za umešení Soni a držení u nás máme bod. Bomba na konci, kolem půl čtvrtý, pokud bude odištěná, tak půl čtvrtý boukne a máme čtvrtý bod. A poslední nejdůležitější to, ty skvěně nám umyslí ministra a jeho udržení. Je to mej, mají ho dole ve vězení, zhruba každých 15 a 20 minut ho povedou se stráží do výslechový hodně kam do mečku. My nevíme kam. Pokud ho do tří hodin neodpohodíme, tak od něho kdykoliv mezi třetí a půl čtvrtou zastřelej, ať ukončí hra. Nejsme na ASOFTu. Musíme plnit úkoly, ty nám přinášejí body. Tu budeme dostat stavit prý na kopce.
kluci a má granáta, má to tam vyčistili a bylo to. Ne? Ne, 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 Sebrali nám ministra. Já Zase jsem vykal tam naleze. Co jsi věděl, že ten mail nebude poslouchat? Good evening, I'm Jayla Anderson and this is Bullet News. We have a significant update on the recent NATO operation targeting the Red Revenge terrorist cell near Prague, formerly known as Red Scorpions. The mission, which aimed to dismantle the terrorist network, has had mixed results, culminating in the tragic execution of Minister Major General Karl May von Mihaj. During the operation, NATO forces managed to secure a crucial refill point, which played an essential role in their tactical maneuvers. They also successfully destroyed targeted buildings with explosives, earning them one score point. Additionally, Major General May was initially rescued during the mission, earning another score point. However, he was recaptured by the Red Revenge in a subsequent defensive engagement near the refill point, resulting in a loss of that crucial point. Unfortunately, the mission fell short of other key objectives. NATO forces were unable to capture the elusive Red Sonja, who remains at large. And despite their efforts, they only neutralized the notorious Butcher four times, falling short of the required seven eliminations for a score point. When the final tally was counted, the operation ended with a score of NATO 1, Red Revenge 3, it seems that Team NATO didn't just blow up the buildings, they failed to capture Red Sonja, didn't kill the Butcher enough times, and ultimately couldn't save Major General May. This outcome underscores the relentless and complex nature of the fight against terrorism, where even the best laid plans can face unforeseen setbacks. Stay tuned to Bullet News for further updates on this developing story. I'm Jayla Anderson. Good night.